Hey guys, how's it going? RGJ Ron here. Let's play Project Frequency number three. And uh, Mr. Bioxide has added in a horde mode, which, to my understanding, is kind of like a uh, nat Nazi zombies in Call of Duty. Also, he added in a few if else for while loop statements, all that sort of Java jazz to fix a few spawning bugs that were present. But I won't know anything about any bugs because I haven't played this for a while. Oh no, my god, it's hurt in the middle of the floor. Why is that? Surrounded by computers. Okay, good. That is uh, very good indeed. Okay. Flares. Gotta, gotta love me some flares. Okay. Anything else? Any weapons around here that I can find? You know, by which to defend myself? Because I'd hate to be drawn into a game with the... Uh, oh, this room is slightly pixelated. Anyway, as I was saying, I'd hate to be drawn into a game without any form of defense. Um... Where does one go about finding weapons? Oh god. I'm already boned. I'm boned. I'm boned as a stone. Hey buddy. Oh shit, they can, they can break in. Oh shit. I have no idea where he came from. Okay, let's do this shit. Okay, I have no idea where he's coming from. I assume he's gonna break down this door next. I'm ready. I'm so ready for this. I'm just waiting, come on. Come on, give me a reason. Give me a reason to use this, come on, I dare you. Okay, come on, I see you out there. Come on! Come on, come on! Come on. There we go. Oh, just give me a reason. Oh shit, I am dead. Whoa. Wowie, wow, wow, wow. Okay, I need a first aid kit. Oh, I don't need a flare. I don't need that flare. Don't need any flares at all at all. So what's the story? Am I safe? Oh well fair play to them. They they were very uh thorough in their searching for me. As futile as it was. Okay, they're coming again. Is there any... Okay, there's lots of ammo, but there's no first aid kits. Okay, um... I've already checked this area. Okay, I'm gonna go back the way I came. Which I believe was... This way. And I'll just go up here, check it out for any, uh, 
first aid kit. No. Okay, still no sign of first aid kit. And we've got a uh, climbing axe. Now I'll uh, stick to this axe. Because I'll be the one axing the questions here. Ha 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 ha. Funny joke isn't funny. I get the deal. Okay. Bring it on. I'm I'm ready for you. Totally ready. Come on. Just let me bash your head in with this axe and we can get it get it over with. Oh. You're not gonna get me? Oh shit! I'm I'm boned. I'm boned here. Look, look. I'm boned, I'm boned. Ah <sighs> no okay. Well that was the horde mode of uh, Project Frequency. A uh, few suggestions. Uh, he, the developer could add, you know, a few more first aid kits and maybe a few guns or a gun next to ammo. Because I seem to be finding a lot of ammo but no guns, and it took me a while to even find a weapon. Maybe you should start off with a basic weapon. I don't know, like a knife, maybe, perhaps. Uh, anyway, I'll go into survive mode and try, try that. Try that one out again. I think there, there's a few bugs fixed in this. What the? What the bloody hell? Where am I? Just oh, it was slightly darker than usual. Okay. That's what I was saying about the horde mode, yeah. Uh, just, if you're going to be spawning ammo, you might as well spawn a gun of some kind next to it. Okay, how do I use the flashlight again? It's B. Okay, that's good. Glitching up at the screen as you know. All flickery and shit. Okay. Yeah, just consumed a can of what's it's what's it's being, I've no idea what it is. Hmm. Hopefully he updated the save mechanic because I found it very hard to save. In fact I couldn't save it all. I couldn't find a floppy disk by which to save. At least I'm assuming that was the way to save because they know up yonder direction. And all the way around there was a computer and they said I need a floppy disk. Oh, hey friend. What? Time to die. Your world is coming to an end. Okay, I'll let him do his one thing up there while I check out this area. Uh, what's this? Oh, a flare. Oh no, I don't want, to, I don't want a flare, I don't want a flare. I want my knife back. Oh! That's how you switch between uh, weapons. Mouse wheel. Oh. It's actually a good way to switch between weapons, actually, instead of uh, the regular, I don't know, keyboard configuration. It's, a, it's a, one thing that um, uh, indie game developers should should consider <laughs> consider doing when making a game like this, some sort of horror game of this description. To switch weapons, it should be the mouse wheel. That is, no, it's easy. That, that's actually quite a nice feature. And I'll just leave you be because I don't know. He don't do deadly squat. Okay, yeah, you're still behind there. Good. 
Now, maybe this time around, hopefully, I'll be able to find a floppy disk. Oh, this sound again. Oh my god, that's so creepy. You know what? I'd be crying like that too if I stopped and dial up internet. Well, not necessarily in that manner, but you know, I'd be pretty depressed. I mean, the only thing I use dial up on these days is with my Dreamcast when I just do, uh, you know, try and play the odd game or two online on it to see if there are some servers still up. Turn on generator and it's her floppy disk. Yeah, but where do, where does one fly find 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 a floppy disk? Generator is almost empty. Okay, that's actually a change. Normally, when I turned it on in the previous version, it would say generator is on or uh, generator is full, something like that. Well. And I noticed that these doors are bolted up as well. That's new. Can I go in these doors? No. Okay, nothing. Okay, then my house may was back. No, he isn't. No, he's not that I know that he is. Not that I know of, I mean. Okay, let's explore this area a bit more. I haven't explored any of these houses here, have I? Oh, I get high. Hey. Oh, Jesus, hell yeah. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Where in the Jesus Mary did you come from? Okay, come on. Come on, I'm ready to take you on. Anyone else? Oh yeah, I see you in there. Okay, someone or something just broke out of somewhere. Where, I do not know. Okie dokie. Seems that this building is kind of dangerous. Monsters, but I don't see monsters. Okay, I didn't mean to eat that, I meant to just pick it up. Just close that door there. Pick this up. Oh, first aid. No, probably need that. Oh, hey, hey, hey! The Jesus Hell Mary was that. Okay, hey there. You wanna go? You wanna go? Oh shit! No! Oh no! No! I'm I'm, I'm screwed. I'm boned. I'm getting gang raped here. Ah. Uh.
Okay, that's one thing I forgot. I forgot that the knife has a certain amount of usage. Oh boy. Okay, I'll leave leave this game alone for a while and come back to it when there's another update. Yeah, I mean, a lot, lot of things that have been have, have improved, I, I, I suppose. Except the save mechanic. I mean, um, so scrap, get, scrap the whole uh, getting a floppy disk thing. I can see where he's coming from. It's, he's sort of trying to make it more like a Resident Evil where you had to get an ink ribbon to, to save your game but the thing is uh, there was plenty of ink ribbons you could, you could get in Resident Evil I mean uh, you sort of knew where to search for them or uh, well you didn't know where to search for them you just uh, randomly found them when you uh, <coughs> explore, explore the mansion but uh, here for the floppy disks you, you have no idea where to get them they, they don't seem to spawn in any particular area not, not from what I could see, but fun thoughts on the horde mode. Yeah, it's all it's all right. It's sort of a a concept a concept of uh, Call of Duty na nasty zombies, but that needs to be improved as well. I mean, there needs to be um, mo more weapons at your disposal. Um, I don't know maybe spawn them closer to where you start off. Or, or at least uh, give a longer, uh, how did say, starting period be before the, the monsters uh, come out to get you and, and kill you and you know uh, eat your guts. Anyway, so, so far, yeah, it's pretty good. It's shaping up to be um, a, a good game. I mean, I've played horrible games in, in horrible indie games in the past. They were all buggy and glitchy, and they're just left like that. But this game is he. He seems to be putting a bit of effort into it. He's he's updated m multiple times, so props for effort. And yes, I will appreciate that. It's still in pre-alpha, so it, it's still going to be buggy. And he's continuing working on it. So yeah, props to you, uh, Mr. Bioxide. So anyway, guys, if you like this video, you know what to do: like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. So until then, see ya.